We are so blessed that there's an F1 circuit in Malaysia and so many organizers are having their track days on almost a weekly basis. So now, you have a really joy few of these track days with your own car, but wanted to be more serious by getting a dedicated track machine for you to conquer the Sabang International Circuits. Today, we will be talking about top 6 cars from 3 manufacturing brands that are under 20k for you to consider. They both have their pros and cons which I will share with you later in this video. Without further ado, let's take a look. Toyota Corolla AE80, aka Toyota LE. You can get it easily under 5k, even under 7k with a silver top or black top, which is the famous 4AGE 20W engine featuring in the initial D. Weighted just under 900 kilos with 130 horsepower on view, it will give you lots of funds on the circuit. This is the first front wheel drive Toyota Corolla launched in 1986 with fairly good handling. I'm owning these track toys now and I can tell you it is really worth every single cent of it. Toyota Corolla AE 100 aka Toyota SEG. The price range is between 8 to 15k depending on the mods and condition of the car. For those SEG above 10k, most likely it will come with the 4AGE 21 blacktop engine which is a very reliable and sought after track engine. The car represents a top notch Japanese technology and build quality back in the 90s era, which is considered the golden time of JDM. Yes, with 10k you can own a JDM, which can have a lot of funds in Sepang. Toyota is famous of its reliability and it has proven in the circuit racing. It might not be so explosive as those VTEX, but it gives you sustainability which makes you longer on the racing track. My car can easily run for 20 to 30 laps without any major issue. Proton Satria Neo 1.6 We have to talk about our national pride which is the Proton Satria Neo. It comes with the SP4H Campro engine and the later batch offer the WAF variable, variable timing which is the CPS model. The car is a typical hatchback offering lots of fun during the cornering. However, please take note that the engine performance could be slightly disappointed for those early batches. With the price range from 16k to 20k, you may get a decent one. Lots of modifications, parts for this car, a choice for some of the seasonal racer in the MSF series. You could never go wrong with this car. Proton Satria 1.6 liter. With just under 10k, you can own a track proven car used by many other before. It is a rebatch of the Mitsubishi Mirage and uses the 4G92 1.6 liters engines, but with below 20k, you can definitely get one with a 4G93 Myrek engine, which is a good enough for a start in Sepang. Again, this is another hatchback car made by Proton back in the 90s. The car can be very light after you stripe off all its interiors. The car is on my top list when I was young to own it, so it's never too late to pursue a dream. Our national brand had partnerships with Mitsubishi before, so these cars are compatible with many parts from Mitsubishi. However, these car parts are getting more expensive nowadays, so please consider if you have a limited budget. Honda Civic EG 1.6 liter. No surprise that the next one will be a Honda. Honda Civic 5th Gen or EG is still a good choice for many due to its compatibility with engine transplants, B16A, 16B, B18C, B20, even K20 or K24, there's so many choices. By just under 10k, you can own a good CC to build a monstrous car which is really can dominate the power with a good setup. This sedan version of EG is still a gem, so go get it before it's too late. Honda Civic EK 1.6 liter. It has to be this model. This car is the 6th gen of the Honda Civic and it is still a very good looking car till now. You can easily get a chase chase by under 10k and spend under 10k on the engine transplants. Definitely a bang for the bucks. 
similar to Honda Civic EG, you can have real serious fun in Sepang by a small budget. The return will be great by owning this model. However, please be considered that these Honda parts ain't cheap, so you may want to plan your budget carefully if you wish to continue to upgrade your car. These Honda cars are JTCC proven, race-winning machines at all time under the 1600cc category. However, Honda is twice as durable compared to Toyota and you might run into overheating issue if it's not set up or tuned properly. Moreover, Honda parts are very expensive due to the high demand from all over the world. So here's my top 6 list for getting a track car just under 20k mark. What do you think? If you have other opinions or some other better suggestions, please do not hesitate to let me know. Thank you for watching and please like and subscribe to my channel for support. I'll see you next time. Bye.